Introducing first, weighing in at 105 pounds, the U.S. Champion, Jason! And ladies and gentlemen, from what we are hearing from the United States Champion Jason is that he is having a challenge, an open challenge for the vacated EBW Hardcore Championship. And who is going to accept this challenge? Introducing weighing in at 130 pounds from East Lake, Ohio. Former number one contender for the E E W Championship, and unfortunately he did come up a little bit short against R G. But you know what? He still came out. He's still walking. He's not crippled. He's standing on two feet. You know something? He is just going to be the one, and he hopes. And these guys set their eyes on the E W Hardcore Championship. Now let's listen to what these two men have to say. To hold one of these championships in EBW. What is that thing that, that uh, what is that RJ said about Stall that he's a new jet? I'm thinking that about you right now, so why do you think that you can hold the championship? Huh? I'm good enough for it. Alright, good enough for it. What makes you think that you're gonna go one-on-one -on -one with the king of hardcore? Because you know something? Ever since I've arrived here, and ladies and gentlemen, this match is a hardcore match, and you can just tell by the look of this ring that this ring is going to be devastating underneath all that stuff. This is even a pro this is properly made to be hurt. This is all tin and steel underneath that ring. But you know what? And a super kick to start off the match. And to start off the match, he's just kicking away and pounding away right onto the midsection of B-Dog. And B-Dog with a kick back. Now what's he doing off the ropes? Now he's picking him up. What's he going for now? Has him up over his shoulder. And an Alabama slam right to the back and sternum of Jason. He may have suffered a broken rib from that. That is just grueling. I've been in that move, and that move does not feel good. It feels like a car wreck. And now he's being picked up in a kick right to the kneecap. And ladies and gentlemen, remember, that kneecap has been surgically repaired three times, and it has been targeted by many EW superstars. And now he has a lead pipe, and he just went down right to the midsection, tossing it out. Now he had him in a rear... Now he had him in a headlock, now he's doing, and a twist of fate, shade of pro wrestler, the Hardy Boys, and now what's he going for, is he going to go for the pin, and he's going to, one, two. two, and a kick out from B-Dog, he keeps, he is going to make sure that he is one to walk out of here with this championship. Oh no, that Jason was going for his flying clothes on and he got caught. You know he still has him. Oh no 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 no! Oh my God! And what a hip toss across the ring and a stop right to the ribs. And from what we can tell, those ribs might be injured from that Alabama slam. And now it's beat all getting. He has that up, and he's catching it. Jason wisely catches that, avoiding any contact. But you know what? Now Jason's doing what needs to be done, and he's doing something, and he's gonna put that right outside the ring, and hopefully, possibly carry this on to the outside of the ring for more entertainment. And what is he doing now? He is setting up that plywood right against that abandoned trailer. This trailer has suffered enough, but you know something? It may suffer more. Oh my god! And he's spearing him up high so he can suffer the pain and agony of not going through there, but is he gonna do it? Oh my god, that bounce off again. 
Ah! Jesus Christ, and I was, oh my God, he almost went through the bottom of that trailer. You just saw Jason in the bottom of that trailer buckle right in half, and you know what? B-Dog is not even suffering any sort of pain from that, and now the, ply the plywood just gave way. He almost got shoved right through the bottom of that trailer. And you know what, when it comes down to a slugfest, I'm going to have to go with Jason. I have a feeling that Jason is going to be the one to walk out with this championship. But if it comes down to a fist of fist cup, I'm going to go with the EBW superstar in B-Dog. And then he right to the temple and he brings him straight down. He's avoiding that grapple. Now what's he doing? What's he going for now? Now he hasn't picked up arms crossed, arms back, and a pedigree. And a pedigree. Now what's he doing for the pin? One. One, one two, two. And a kick out from B-Dog. A kick out from the former number one contender. This match has been grueling so far. And you can see those lead pipes that are used for the ring posts. Now it's he has that. And remember, in between those, that wood, that is actually caked aluminum. So when you get thrown into that, it basically feels like you're getting thrown into a car wreck. And right through it. Sage just got thrown right through that goddamn. He may have suffered some. He may have suffered some debilitating injuries. This match is not going to stop under any pressure. This match is not going to stop on the other terms. This match is going to stop when these EBW superstars have had enough. And you know what? That may be never. Oh my god, what the hell? Jason just ripped that off with one hand. He's getting back in the ring. He's telling him to put it down. He's putting it down. And now what's he doing? And a suicide dive right off the top rope onto Jason, courtesy of B-Dog. How much more can they suffer? Now he's putting that on by the midsection. Oh, and a stop right to the chest. Fuck, it smells like shit over here. Oh, goddamn. Fuck. All right. Now what is he doing? He has him set up, bounding him right in the head with that, putting it down, and a kick right to the kneecap once again. That is his left kneecap that is being totally ripped apart. Fuck. Oh my. Jesus Christ. Now what's he doing? He has that big, long... This is no good. He's getting back in the ring. He's telling him. He's angling. He's forwarding him. He is directing him right back into the ring. And now what's he doing? He has him in a headlock. Grappling. And and now it is a fist of cuff. These guys are trading blows. Back and forth. Jason. B-Dog. Jason. B-Dog. Jason. 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 Jason's going after him. And now what's he doing? Oh my god, and a flying whip down of a DDT. Oh my god. Shove that camera guy right out of the way. This is gruesome. This is gruesome, ladies and gentlemen. And back of the head may have been... Oh, oh, and B-Dog countered. B-Dog put his legs out and he moved away from that. But, you know, Jason's back. This guy is not human. Jason is back up. Oh, no, 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 no. No, what's he doing? What's he doing? Oh, my God, and a face plant off the top of the shoulders, courtesy of B-Dog. This is... Oh, my God. Can he be... Can he continue? He's getting back up. Oh, and a kick right to the elbow. Now what's he doing? Now what's he going for? Now what's he doing? And a push and a what a what a knock that was. Right to the side of the chin. Now these two men are going after each other right in front of that aluminum cake steel plywood. Now what's he doing? He's going to take off that turnbuckle. 
and maybe he had a change of heart and decided not to. Oh, and a punch right to the temple. He's not even suffering anything. And a kick to the kneecap once again. Now whoever comes out on top, their opponent is not, these men are never going to be the same again after this match. And a grapple and a tie up. Kick to the kneecap again. And a super kick right to the chin. And another one. And that was just a kick right to the midsection. And a drop kick. Almost sending Jason scurrying. Flying right out of the ring. Is this it? Boy, one. Two. Two. Oh my god, no. What is he going to have to do to end this match? This is just gross. This... <sighs> What are these men going to have to do? What heights or levels are these guys going to have to go through just to finish this off and one of them successfully walk out of here as the EBW Hardcore Champion? And you know what? Jason has nothing to lose. He has the EBW United States Champion around his waist. Championship. And now, what? that was just a wicked DDT. Is he going to roll him over? No, no, no. He's back up. What's he doing? Off the ropes. Oh my god, and he got him right in the eyes. But remember, hardcore match. This is it. And a curb stomp right onto that cake. Aluminum of that board. That is the wicked. This is, it's over. It's over. One, One two, two three. three. And your winner is B-Dog. B-Dog is the new EBW hardcore champion. What a match this has been. We have a new champion. As the United States Champion lays down in despite in the middle of the ring. I cannot believe what we have witnessed here tonight. RJ, I hope and remember, as of late, you guys, you as of late, Jason has been calling out and he has been trash talking RJ. And you know something? I think that he may be coming after the EBW Championship next, but... Anything can happen here in the EBW. Just what will happen? Will RJ respond? But will he talk more stuff? What is this going to be? And we know who RJ is. RJ just cowards out of everything. But you know something? This is going to be a wicked confrontation. And there he is, ladies and gentlemen, the EBW champion holding up his title. As he's looked at and despite talking some trash to Jason. You can take this. You just lost to B Dog. And I beat him. So what makes you think if you lost to him that you can beat me for this? Look at me when I'm And a slap to the side of the face. Is this us, man? Does RJ have a death wish? What is wrong with him? And now it's to do trading blows, going after one another. Going after one another. And I needed the forehead. Oh my god, and a super kick to the EBW champion in RJ. Oh my god. Could this be the future of the EBW? And you know something? If it is, the future is now. As the EBW United States Champion walks out, and you know something? Thank you for joining us tonight here on the EBW Super Show.